Hi, it's Sabine. I'm showing you my old photo album. I will continue to show you some pictures from the past. Hi, my friends. I'm looking forward to showing you these special pictures. And um, I'm glad that you encouraged me to make a part two. I may even make part three, but another a video where I show more pictures um, from my other photo albums. Let's get started. I'll show it to you. I got this photo album from my mother. Let me show you. I'll show you the picture of me again after I was born. Like I said, I was born early after eight months and I found my hat, my little hat, a crocheted hat the other day that I had saved. I'll show that to you too later on. I showed you this picture already at my great-grandmother's house. I was blonde when I was little. I don't know exactly how old I was at the time. And this is such a beautiful album. Do you see those spider webs here? And that special paper. And this is my mother. And here I'm waving. Look at how my mother dressed. And look at her hairdo. I'm trying to keep the clear out of the pictures. And it says Fruchtsaftgetränk here. Fruit juice drink. That's just a, a brand that we have in Germany. I don't know if we have it anymore. It's just like Fanta, you know. Bluna. And this is in front of the bakery. And let me show you what's back there. I've had a couple of those as a teenager. They were expensive, so we did not get those often. It's a hedgehog made out of chocolate, a pastry. As far as I remember um, from what my grandmother told me, is that my mother worked here. These are relatives of hers, and um, my mother did the household for them. They're bakers. They had their own store, their own bakery. And it was the only bakery in town for a very long time. I guess there's a picture missing. You see these little corners? How you put the picture in those? Yeah, I guess that's what they had in the old times, I guess. Maybe not all around the world, but in Germany, obviously. Let's look at some more. Look at this baby carriage. And yes, that's me. Wow, look at that antique. Looks like Wickle. I love it, don't you? This one I showed you before. In my other video. 
I got another camera and this one doesn't make that much lens noise yet. Unfortunately, when I showed you my other video, there was lens noise in there. And this is my father's sister. Her name is Traude. That's her nickname. Her real name is Edel Traud. <laughs> I got lots of pictures when I was young, didn't I? I'll show you more. This is my grandmother, my mother's mother. We lived in her house. They built a new house when I was that young. Look at all that wood back there. And look at the chickens. I remember that still today. I don't know. I think I do. Maybe just from the pictures, but it's, it's probably too young to remember that you were out with the chickens, you know. And later on they had a balcony here, right up there. But that's the way it used to look like. Maybe that was still part of the old house. That's where they were building the new house, the one I grew up in. You see? In Germany we don't build the houses out of wood like here in America. They're built with those stones. Look at that. I don't really know what you call them. More like cinder blocks? Look at that, my grandmother. Let me try and get the clay out of here. My grandmother took care of me a lot when I was little. She was like a mother to me. So when she died, after I married my husband in New York City, I was very, very, very sad. But I came to America and met my husband after two weeks being here in, in, this, in this country, in the United States of America. I got a telegram from my father that said my grandmother had passed away. That's all it said. That was horrible. Telephone calls were really expensive back then. And they sent a telegram. I cried and I cried and I cried. <laughs> 